Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray and my commentary partner here on the Gatry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And it's match day one in the group stage for these two nations here at the 2023 Women's World Cup. It's Australia versus the Republic of Ireland. Well, thanks Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. And the starting 11 for Australia. Well, in this shape, their two holding midfield players will be key today. If they can get on the ball and dictate the play, protect the two centre-backs, it will then allow the attacking players to show their creative quality. This is the starting 11 for the Republic of Ireland. Well, in this system, I'm not sure how they're going to pose a threat going forward. The centre forward will certainly struggle to get any support, and there doesn't seem to be any attacking width. And the match is underway. of forward momentum here but can they produce the save was a good one an example of how to press forward Katrina Gorey it has to be quite simply an opportunity wasted easy for the keeper Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. Well, a thoroughly disappointing attempt with that free kick. Well, we know she's such a good player and a good free kick taker as well, but that was a really poor effort. She needed to get that much closer to the goal. Megan Campbell. Well, there to intercept. Just trying to drive her team forward here. 
a really committed challenge and it's gone out for a throw-in Anna O'Gorman she's made a really important challenge Ford now with Gori useful looking position you've got to say but really sticking to the task defensively useful looking ball real chance and a goal now they have their opener and now they can celebrate well here it is again and it's all about the pace in transition they're so quick to get out from the back and the finish is really good. She just smashes that past the keeper. That's a top quality goal. Well, that'll be a free kick. No yellow card. Instead, a firm warning from the official. towards goal determined block oh fine well really fine goalkeeping good diving stop keen to take it short here Well, the initial save is a good one, as you can see, but unfortunately, it drops straight to an opponent. A bit unlucky, really. So, underway again here, on the back of that leveller. Gorman. And the referee blows for a foul. Well, she's been warned, but not cautioned in this case. And deep into the penalty area. And clears the danger. On a pass that lacks quality. Polkinghorn. Here's Rasso. And super tackle, and they've won possession. Heather Payne. Megan Campbell. A oh, super piece of play. Well, the crossing needs to be a bit better than that. Rasso Carpenter superbly read and executed so the whistle then we're up the halfway stage in the and the contest begins 